Iris Ruth Pastor, award-winning Huffington Post blogger, motivational speaker, author, storyteller, and seeker of wisdom. A coping guru who advocates for us to all preserve our blooms, to use our talents and resources to be the best we can be. Not perfect, but certainly good enough. Iris is not comfortable delivering the same speech over and over again, so she customizes each presentation to fit the needs, interests, and demographics of her audience. She advocates pushing the boundaries of your personal comfort zone to stretch and grow. I thought it was lovely. She is a hoot. She has so much to say in such a fun way, and I thought it was great from the start to the finish. The things that are strong in us, we have to preserve and we have to take care of or they're going to wither and die too. But you have to feed it. I think it relates to a lot of different people on a lot of different levels. And it was a very nice event. And it's just like, you know, it's just live with a little flash and dazzle. You only go around once. It was wonderful. Very, very funny. Very enlightening. And I could totally relate to everything she said. The next thing about living happily ever after is doing something that scares you. It, it was wonderful and I think she hit the points of why everyone needs to remember to stay happy. I really enjoyed the event. Um, my favorite part um, was probably the cheers. Cheer number one. Ayenta Talabenta, do not be. A woman of valor is what the world should see. Balabusta, you should be to your groom. But don't forget to preserve your own bloom. Iris was hysterical and witty, and her comments were full of wisdom, and um, I really enjoyed the Yiddish part of it. It uh, harkened back to uh, having a little bit of that peppered into my upbringing, so I, I, I thought it was a very enjoyable way to spend an afternoon. One of the ways I started helping myself get, get over this feeling of feeling kind of isolated and alone was telling people. So to be honest, I'm sure there were a lot of people that were like, oh my God, I knew there was something wrong with her now. You know, the whole, the whole gamut. I just want to say that I just came from the luncheon and I enjoyed the speaker very much. The other side of the coin was that people started coming up to me and telling me about their demons. And these were people that looked just like us and they had all kinds of things going on. It was pretty fantastic. I loved her genuineness and her sharing a piece of her story and her life so that other women could um, really learn from that wisdom. Iris is available for speaking engagements all over the country and abroad, addressing diverse audiences of varying backgrounds on the importance of self-growth, self-care, and soaring, not just coping. Book today.